Hey, welcome back to another video. This one will be pretty short. Uh, after my 80,000 mile checkup with Lexus, they told me the air conditioning needed to be recharged. The air still blows cold, so I don't know if it's actually low, but or if it's just something that they say that you should do. I'll just show you how to do it in case you need to do it. So these are three different types I've used. I've used this one here. I don't really like this one. This is by far the best, this uh, AC Pro. I really, I only buy the largest cans because if you saw my other video of my 2010, it only takes Freon from the big cans. And then once the can has 20% left, which this one does, it doesn't actually take up any more at all. So uh, actually both these have about 20%. This is a brand new can. So I'll hook up to this one and see if it takes the rest. Okay, first thing you wanna do is turn the car on Turn the air all the way up. All right, before things get too hot, you've got a high and a low. You're gonna undo the low. And then this, will just push right on. see we are right at the bottom of build so actually it can use some freon so shake this up a little bit now what you want to do is you want to hold it upright so we're going to pull the trigger hold it upright and i'm going to turn it sideways and back up every five seconds or so i don't know if that's what the instructions say so that's what i'm going to do Can is getting cold, so it's definitely going in. Which is good. Okay. This can feels empty. So pop this off by squeezing this. That one's empty. All right. Let's see if this one's got anything in it. All right, still shows the same. Oh, this is taking some too. Can's getting cold, it's a good sign. It's definitely going up, it's good. All right, it's looking good. I don't feel much else going in, so we're probably good enough. So the needle moved up a little bit. Yeah, it's freezing cold in here now. So I didn't even realize that uh, it was not blowing cold, but uh, I guess they test the pressure and just to see if it has enough. And, and they said it was like right on the border of being low and, and filled. I went through those two, the last of little 20% of those two cans and it definitely took some. You don't need to be all the way up into the green. I think if it's just touching the green, you're fine. Cause you don't want to risk putting too much in or creating like high pressures. That, and so you're better off just, if it's in the green, you're good. If it's on the border of green, then put some in. So that that's my thought. It took some and I've got another can, another brand new can that I can use for the future. So hope this video helped until next time.